This video is detailing how to use the uh, patch supplied in the issue queue. So uh, what I have here as a problem is my grouping field uh, that I'm ordering things by is in a field collection. And so as you can see, summer is actually the value that I want to group on. Uh, but the issue is that it's coming from two different nodes. And so it groups all the records together against that node, but it's actually against that node and then against the title of the node. Uh, or against the title of the node, which it doesn't natively do. So what the patch does is, let me see, in here I have field collection, semester. Um, and so it groups on semester just fine, but it needs to actually group on the name of the semester and not just everything coming in on that record. So what you do is you'll see grouping field shows up. Uh, I prune out all options except the first one because that's the only one that makes sense. And then you can only group on one item because any more than that might be really complicated at the moment. So I'm going to tell it to group on that value. And then just before it sends the query out to get rendered, what it does is it actually pulls these values together. So now you see summer is actually one value because the word summer was in there multiple times. Um, so that's, that's effectively what the patch does, which you group the data to an additional degree based on what the value is. Um, the reason that that's important is a lot of times when you're dealing with entities, it'll have an ID. Um, and the IDs might be, might be the same, they might be different. Um, in the case of content, in this case, you know, content ID, note ID will be like 27 or whatever, and the next one will be 28, but they might both be called summer. And so because they're both called summer, I want to group them on that. Um, so that's, that's effectively what problem this solves. Um, to showcase it with a different level of grouping, um, we have a habit at the program level. Yeah, so I my offerings. This is a different view now. Um, and so we can do course. And so because we're grouping by course, um, this is an instance I was just referring to. So you have sections and offerings which are providing data points as to seats filled and seats offered, um, but they're related to uh, the course node. And so you would effectively get, you know, R20, 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 R20 for each one of these records. And um, I can show this by disabling the grouping. So if I go in to the settings for this and we'll disable this grouping here and apply, see what the original result would have been. Uh, without employing this technique. And so this is what it would have looked like is each individual instance of the record is mapped out um, across the you know, of these semesters. And so this data doesn't really mean anything in this form. So that's effectively what the group by uh, value is getting you and this patch is getting you. So I hope that it gets included in my it's very useful, otherwise I'll just use another one.